good morning grade 4 today's topic is about physical and chemical changes let's start as we studied before everything around us is matter and matter has three states which are solid liquid or gas all these states undergo two types of changes which are physical and chemical changes let's start with a physical change a physical change happens when a substance changes but no new substance is formed a physical change can change one of the physical properties of matter like size shape matter can dissolve state of matter can also change let's have a look here here is a glass of liquid water and by freezing you will change the state of matter from being liquid to solid ice is the solid state of water what happened here it's just a physical change water is still water but it changed it from a liquid state to a solid state so physical changes happen when matter changes its property but not its chemical nature water is still water Physical property changes could include a change in texture, shape, size, color, volume, weight, density, any of these physical properties. But again, matter is still the same. No new substances is formed. Let's have some examples about physical changes. The first one is melting of ice. Here. A cube of ice is melt. A cube of ice is melting to the liquid water again. So it's a physical change. A second example is tearing of paper into small pieces. Of course, it's clear here that the size changes to be smaller pieces. Another one blowing up a balloon when you blow up air in the balloon yeah the size changes sewing wood look here he's cutting or sewing the wood so its shape and size is changed disappearing puddles when it rains Sometimes some parts on the floor will have puddles of water and after some time these puddles disappear because of evaporation. The heat of the sun starts to evaporate this liquid water and the water vapor starts to fly up with the air. Yes, and it's a physical change. now let's move to the second type of changes that could happen to matter which is a chemical change what is a chemical change a chemical change is a change matter undergoes when it comes new or different matter when a substance undergoes a chemical change it changes into a different substance with different properties let's have some examples here the first one is rusting of iron when you look here for these nails of course we know how do they look like it's the original shape of nails they are silver they are shiny and they are hard when they are exposed to the atmospheric air they will get crust and this means that their color will change their texture will also change here burning of paper 
this is the paper when you start to burn it a new substance is formed which is ash but the question here can you return this ash back to be paper the answer is no because in chemical changes the substance which is formed cannot change back to be the original one another example is toast burning of course here the smell will change the texture will also change so it's a chemical change rocket fuel burning of course it's a chemical change candle burning chemical change now let's summarize what we said the first the first one is physical changes a physical change is a change of matter from one form to another without forming a new substance or changing its nature the same substance is still here only some of its physical properties change another change is a chemical change it's a change that happens when one or more substances change into entirely new substances with different properties so a new substance is formed thank you grade four